Hudson Taylor. First off, I gotta get in real close here for. A, Oh, that is a mustache. Oh. And, and what, what's 125's name? I, I couldn't... Pat Stritsky. Stritsky, but I was calling him Stashky. That works, too. Okay. Yeah. All right, Hudson. Uh, saw you. You guys were doing conditioning after after the fact, but you pin a lot of guys, man. Do you think you need to refocus maybe on cardio? Uh, well, I think that come national tournament, you know, when you start getting uh, wrestling with higher-level guys, it's going to be harder and harder for me to get those pins. So uh, I think that what's going to make the difference in, you know, getting bonus points or getting the pin or even just getting the win is going to be cardio because come the national tournament, you know, if I'm in a better shape than my, guy, than my opponent uh, and I can wear him down, then chances are I'm going to come away with a win and hopefully maybe even a pin. Okay, today you had a, a tough match against Purdue. Okay, uh, Logan Brown, he's an NCAA qualifier, pretty tough guy. But, you know, you get like, a strong guy like that underneath you and you can't get your legs in and you, you can't do all the turns and all the crazy things on top. Yep. What's the approach there when you get a real strong guy like that? Uh, you know, I, when I wrestle a guy like that, I oftentimes get too focused on trying to get my pin, trying to get my moves. And, uh, you know, going forward, I'm going to have to sort of say, you know, if I'm not getting my turn, Cut them, get a takedown. Get, a, get another takedown, you know. Start to sort of expand my repertoire, expand what I'm looking to get. And I think that if I can do that, if I can dominate in other positions, then the back points will come, the fall will come. So for me, it's, you know, Hudson, don't, don't just look for the pin. Uh, you know, look for other stuff. And, uh, good things will happen. Okay, you are, you've been amazing in the, in the consolation bracket of the NCAAs, okay? Uh, third twice, correct? Yep. All right. How important is, is it to you to get that title this year? This is it. Uh, you know, I, I have three, three months left in my college career, uh, and everything that I don't do each and every day is something that you know, I'm going to regret. So I'm not leaving anything to chance. You know, at the end, I run stadiums trying to get that cardio, trying to get stronger in the weight room, just trying to you know, do everything I possibly can to, to win a national championship. And uh, I think that if I can keep my head on my shoulders and just wrestle smart and have fun, uh, I think I have a good shot of doing that. How is the major going? First off, what's it called again? Interactive performance art. You made that up. I did. But you were able to justify it. Yes. Yeah. How is? It? Well, t tell me about it. And what's the daily? The daily. Uh, what's the schedule? So um, the way it works is I define my major. Uh, I write it for prospectus, and I choose my curriculum based on existing classes. So. Uh, Last semester, I took uh, I take a bunch of philosophy classes, American studies, uh, and then some art and some theater. Uh, this coming semester, I got my independent study, my, my senior thesis coming up, uh, in which I'm going to uh, sort of put together three separate interactive performance art pieces and, and write a paper, and uh, it should be should be fun. I mean, it's going well. I'm gonna have to come check that out. You man. should. Sounds you should. pretty sweet. It'll be, it'll be on film, so I'll uh, I'll upload it online. Oh, that'll be awesome. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is there anything else you want the people to know about what Hudson Taylor is doing in Maryland? Uh, just making good things happen, uh, having fun. All right, man. Keep it up. Good luck. And uh, hopefully we can see you on top of the podium in March. Great. Thank you.